guys, it's Julia, and for today's video, I'm actually going to be doing a bullet journal video. So this is my bullet journal. It's the Loistrum 1917, very common one, and I'll link everything I used in the description box and all that stuff. Planning for January, I decided to go with more of a prominent theme. So I decided to go with a Hannibal theme. So for my monthly page, I did a deer skull with a bunch of flowers and stuff like that. And then just wrote out January. I might add on to this to make it a little bit nicer, but I'm not really sure at the moment. So this is my monthly page. And clearly I just did like the whole calendar layout and things like that. So again, my theme was the Hannibal TV series. So I put the picker in and some washi tape and New Year's Day. And then in light blue, I have just some book releases. So um, this boy is a rainbow, gunslinger girl in Zenith. And then I might be going to a signing on the 20th for Zenith, but I'm kind of still seeing. I might, and then I have my low my law culminating on the 12th, and then I just have to add in some more culminating exam dates, and then me time, this is just my gist day, which was created by Kayla Nicholson, so this is my get your shit together day. I usually, I kind of stopped doing it for a bit, but I'm wanting to start again. For this page, I'm just going to be writing down my monthly favorites, um, the books I've read, my TBR, which I've already started, so Fangirl, Misery, Zenith, and then a classic of the month. And for my word of the month, I decided to go with bravery. This is going to be my mood tracker, which I've never done before. So I have three different, like more of a orange, like orangey kind of color, a pink and then a bright red. And I just have a bunch of blood splatters that I'm going to be shading into every day, depending on my mood, which I just went with like three basic ones. So this, my mood definitely fluctuates. So it's definitely going to be going to be like the average kind of thing. So, you know, sad, normal, happy, that kind of thing. And then I also have my habit tracker, which I'm gonna get back into. So I have water, so I put two plus, so that's like two, so that's going to be at least two bottles, meds, my night guard, f wash my face, makeup, study, film, edit, read, just to see if this at all impacts my mood in different ways. And, I and then over here I have my YouTube page. So this, I think my writing is too tiny for you to see anyways. If not, I'll blur it, but I just put some, again, some photos, and I like doing more of a vertical layout for my YouTube thing. So for example, when I did Vlogmas, I went back and I kind of did something like this, which I really like doing that. So that's what I'm gonna be doing this month, and I'm not gonna be uploading every day, but I like to see the layout like this, and then I just have some ideas, some requested things. So this is my Bujo plan with me. Yes, because you guys want to see that. So. Um, cat. Sorry, I had to shoo him away. Um, this is my brain dump page, so this is just going to be writing down random thoughts, things like that. So I have just a picture of Hannibal again there. Flipping the page, I have my first weekly spread. So I got these little guys from Muji, and it just has all the days of the week. And I love that the first falls on a Monday, just because it's so much easier to plan this way. So I just did a basic weekly spread with Remember, and then some two more photos to go with my theme. This one I really like how I did this. So this is going to be my week two. Cat, this is so difficult to film, go away. Ow! <laughs> this is going to be just to-do lists, um, quote here, and then just some more photos to go with the theme. Then week three is kind of shaped out like this. So I have just a quote that says, you won't like me when I'm psychoanalyzed, just a Nelson Mandela quote, which doesn't really go with the theme, but I like the colors in the quote, which it always seems impossible till it's done. Another one of the Muji weekly views, and then just the boxes. And then for my last week, um, I just went with basic font and just kind of simple. And I did in a bright red and wrote, this is my design. And then this is actually the last week, which is just Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, the last few days. And it's going to be my January memories page, which I've never done a page like this before, but I thought I'd give it a shot. Um, this, I'm just gonna be writing down some memories from this month. And then I also glued in a little pocket. So I'm gonna be putting any ticket stubs, any, I don't know, any little receipts, anything like that in this little guy. So that is my overview for January 2018. Let me know how you got, let me, let me know how you guys like this video in the comments down below. Um, sorry again for all the complications, the camera movements, just give me a bit. This is my first bullet journal video. So just give me a bit to adjust to getting my camera angle right. And then 
things like that. I'm not used to this, but I've always wanted to do a video like this, so I hope it wasn't bad for a beginner's first bullet journal video, but yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this and it maybe inspired you um, for your own bullet journal. I know I really love watching these videos when I'm planning my own, and next time I will do like an actual plan with me like sped up version because I know those are fun to watch as well. But I thought I'd just you got, give you guys like a flip through of my January 2018 bullet journal setup. So thank you guys so much for watching. The